welcome to Terribly Accurate. Thanks for showing up if you're new or if you've been here before. Either way, please check out the description box below for my little love note of gratitude for you watching these and for helpful links to um, finding out things like your sun sign, your moon sign, blah, blah, blah. Let's just get right to your reading for today. Now, um, a couple different cards. We're going to start with the dog, okay? So the dog says, your loyalty and faithfulness is misplaced by serving too many masters. So maybe you have too much on your plate, too many obligations. Um, maybe you're really working hard at your job, but then you know you have all these obligations with your relationship, with your children, um, with your friendships, and it's kind of wearing you down, right? Like all of those things are super important to you, but it's like, oh my goodness, like how can I pacify all of these people, all of these circumstances, all of these situations in my life and still have me time? And so what that's kind of doing is that's making you here feel pretty lonely, okay? You've got loneliness. And what it says there is, I know that I'm never alone. So that's saying, you know, you do have angelic support around you. You can ask God, Allah, spirit guides, angels, the universe for help in, um, and like kind of guiding you as to where you should put your energy first. But the other thing with this card is saying that if you're not taking care of yourself, if you are not being good to you, it's really, really difficult to um, be good to all of these other people, to do your best for um, everyone else that's demanding your attention. It's like you're feeling um, like a tug of war of all of these different things demanding you. And it's like, whoa, whoa, whoa. You know, I'm in a really lonely spot where people don't understand me and they don't understand my struggles. And, and so call on your angels. Call on the spirit guides um, for help with that, okay? Now, your angel card for today, um, Asriel, we've had before recently. I don't know. If, I think it was like two weeks ago. And um, this one's saying you really need to trust your inner guidance more. Follow your intuition, your gut instincts, okay? Um the more that you learn to trust your gut instincts, the more reliable they will become. So um, I would use that definitely in trying to ascertain what is the most important thing, where do I need to go first, the most important thing after, caring for myself. You know, because you're kind of um, putting in disposition where you're spread too thin and then you feel like you're failing everybody and it makes you feel really lonely and down on yourself. So um, follow your gut instincts as to where your priority needs to be. But what it's kind of saying, if you see all this blue, your priority needs to be with communication. And that makes total sense here when we have the Page of Swords, which is about communication. Where it's, because, um, and the reason I say blue is because that's your throat chakra. Okay, um, so maybe you have a throat chakra blockage. Maybe you want to do a throat chakra um, meditation or something like that. But being honest with yourself, coming up with new ideas, um, allowing with this card and this one in combination, allowing ideas from the divine to come into your head and then applying them in your life as to how you're going to work out that balance so you're not feeling so alone in your struggle. Or even asking other people for help, trying to delegate, explaining to them that you do feel this way, that you do feel like you're spread too thin, that you've taken too much on. Um, definitely communicating those things and um, allowing other people to help you, okay? Now our color energy for the today, you'd expect it to be blue, but it actually isn't. It's cherry, and it says live an extraordinary life. So this color is going to help you to raise your self-esteem. Um, it helps attract abundance and opportunity into your life. And so you could use this by um, wearing this color. It's a great color for fall, actually, for, um, like you could imagine a cherry light ray kind of shining over your head and going through your body or over it. You could eat cherries, cherry flavored anything to kind of embrace this color energy today. But your daily affirmation for this one is divine intelligence. Please give me the courage to become extraordinary and to make my dreams and goals and desires a reality. So maybe with this one here, what it's saying is that, you know, your dreams and your desires, your goals, have taken a back seat. Um, you know, you're feeling kind of, um, what's the word? Depleted. You're feeling depleted because you're so busy worrying about everybody else, trying to make sure that your kids have their goals, de desires, dreams met. You know, that your spouse is meeting their goals. Um, 
you know, all of these people that you love, all of these obligations that you have, and it says go with your instincts and go within and, and care for yourself first. Let other people know that you matter right now. Um, in my love relationship, you know, I always have a hashtag I matter when I'm when I'm feeling my like my needs aren't being met. Like that's a text message that that I had sent quite a few times. Um, but maybe that's something you want to do, you know? Sonia matters. Julie matters. Brad matters. You fucking matter, okay? Um, but you have to remind people of that because they get so used to you giving of yourself, depleting yourself, that they kind of forget that. And then you're isolated and you're feeling like in this really alone kind of space. So, you know, figure out what is it that matters to you? What are your goals? What are your dreams? What are your desires? And communicate those with other people because I think that they will see that you're a generous soul and will want to be generous with you in return. Love and light. I will see you, of course, tomorrow for your daily reading. Um, but in the meantime, if you'd like a personal reading, I'm always honored to read cards for you. Uh, my contact information is below in the description box. And love you. Bye.